Hi everyone, welcome back to the next video of this entire series where we are talking about SharePoint Online. In the last video, we learned how to integrate Power Apps with SharePoint Online. We build an application using SharePoint List. We learned how to customize the application. We learned how to publish the application, how to share the application with users and how to access a Power Apps application on mobile phone. In this particular video, we will learn how to integrate Microsoft Excel with SharePoint Online. If you want to export data from a SharePoint list, you can click export and you can export this information in Excel file or within a CSV file, or you can export this using Power BI. Let's export this data to Excel. Now, when you export a SharePoint list to Excel file or to CSV file, that data is a static data. That means if I make any changes within this contact list from SharePoint site, these changes will not reflect within this CSV file. So to overcome this situation, we can create a connection between Microsoft Excel and SharePoint Online. So let me open a new window of Microsoft Excel. To connect Microsoft Excel with SharePoint Online, within Excel, you will go to Data tab and you will click Get Data. Now from here, you can select a data source to fetch your data. For example, you can use a file, you can use database, you can connect Azure services as a data source, or even you can use Power Platform. But for this demo, we will use SharePoint Online as a data source. So we will click from online services, and here we will select from SharePoint Online list. Under site URL, we will type the URL of the SharePoint site that we want to connect with Microsoft Excel. So we will go back to SharePoint site and from here we can copy the site name. Our site name is IT. So we will copy the URL till IT and go back and paste the URL here and click OK. On this prompt, we will select Microsoft account and click sign in. And here you need to type the credentials of a SharePoint administrator or a global administrator. And click connect. On the left, we can see the navigator where we can see the site list document libraries, and we can see other components. If you select any library, on the right, you can see preview of the document library. Or if I select, for example, a list, we have a list with name contact list. So on the right, we can see all the information that we have within this list we can see names mobile number email address and we can see other information as well so in this demo we will use contact list to connect with excel so we will select contact list and click load and we have all the data of this contact list to this excel file we can see the default columns and the items of this list and we can see the other columns as well, like the name, mobile number, email address, and other fields. Now, this data is not static. That means if I make any changes within the SharePoint site list, those changes will be updated within this Excel file in real time. Let me show you this practically. Let's go back to SharePoint site and let's add few details here.
And let's go back to Excel file and click refresh. And here we can see the new entry is updated. So now you can sort this data. You can create pivot table. You can use formulas and whatever changes you will do in SharePoint site list will get updated here. So this is how you can integrate Microsoft Excel with SharePoint Online. So that is all for today. If you learned something new from this particular video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel. And if you have questions or suggestions, feel free to write them in the comments below. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.